black light burns is, I can definitely say it's not the black light that's like the purple light that lights up like, like uh, headshot posters of Led Zeppelin and Pink Floyd. It's not that kind of black light. Uh, so it's called Stop a Bullet. It means something really personal to me, but with uh, whether it's with my paintings or songs or lyrics or band names or album names or whatever, I feel like it's important to present just like as much as I have presented, that's what I would like people to kind of look at and, and, and if there's, there's no code to uncrack really, there's just, it's just sort of a, uh, I'd rather people interpret for themselves what the songs mean because I think that makes it more personal and important for the listener. The inspiration for this band was was uh, getting no help from anyone, and and like basically being kind of isolated and, and having to only depend on myself to demo out a whole record and write everything, and uh, and then having like a couple of my friends, basically Danny Loner, Josh Eustace, and Josh Freeze, come in and help complete some of the ideas. That, that I had and helped me carry those out. But uh, depending on people for short periods of time was a lot easier than depending on someone for, you know, somebody to be a partner in this with me. So the whole band was inspired by just me working and pulling whatever I kind of strings I could to get something accomplished, you know, basically renting tools instead of having my own, you know, to get something made and, and finished. Whenever I write it, most of the time it's, it's, it's something inside that has to get out. Like it's, a lot of the songs, the, all the lyrics will get written in like five minutes. And, because it's just an idea that all of a sudden just sort of, I don't ever feel like I really write a song. It's, I feel more like, something else like an outside force compels me to to like vomit out some kind of idea really fast and i just have to get it down and then it kind of writes itself a lot of the time sometimes songs are harder to write sometimes it takes a long time but most of the songs on cruel melody came really fast and the idea was it's sort of like getting a little electric shock and the idea just has to get itself out Whether people think I'm, you know, a, a really great painter or a lousy painter or the dude from Limp Bizkit with the black contact lenses, it's like, you know, there's all kinds of different thoughts about me and, um, yeah, all I can do is, is continue doing what I'm doing and let there be more thoughts. That group of people together helped make everybody in that band, you know, bring them to who they are today and where they are today. and. Um, I, I just don't identify with those people anymore and there's a sadness when people are constantly like some of the Limp Bizkit fans constantly don't like have the wrong idea about why the band broke up and stuff like that um, you know because they have no idea what went on in the band and don't understand why we can't continue to get along and make music together it's it's just and you can try to explain it a million times, but it's impossible. If I was able to make music with them, I definitely would, you know, if I was able to communicate and have a band with those people, but um, I'm not, so I, I'm doing this. And there's no real need for me to get away from it. It's just for me to, you know, the only thing I ever wish is that people would set me free and allow me to, like as far as like with their expectations and allow me to just sort of be who, whoever I can and be. I constantly want to like get an idea down and then I'm tired of it and I want to move on and do something else and like I feel like after somebody's, a, after I've gotten through like one 
thing that I'm working on and gotten it out of my system, I'm, all, I'm ready to move on to something else. And I think that for the first time in my life, Blacklight Burns is an idea that can embrace several different kinds of ideas. So it's um, a moniker in which I can work over a long period of time instead of like just being a project. The expectations of, of this are more to present something. Uh, I only expect to, to live up to whatever my, my own vision is. I don't expect anyone to accept it. I feel like I'm functioning better now as an artist than I ever have in my life and I just want this, my only expectation of this is just to have a, an outlet to express myself and hopefully uh, make enough of a living to continue to be able to do it, you know, without having to like give up and pull back and figure out something else to, you know, pay the bills. Just like you.